Hello everyone, welcome back again to JN Electric YouTube channel. Do you already know what I am going to present this? That's right, I am present to you an MI500 to 2 power channel power amplifier. This amplifier was just launched at the end of this year and it is quite new. Let's watch this video and now we show you the specification. By having a power capacity of 500 watt at 8 ohm and 800 watt at 4 ohm on the front panel they are to the left and right of the power peak meter and there are three LEDs and one power button which is on the right side front panel display and switch meter indicators left channel amplifier output LED indicators various left channel circuitry function LED standby power indicator MB indicates when maximum power output for the channel has a courage with the propension of the audio clipping. And red indicates current limit or short circuit for the channel loudspeaker output connection. The depth of this amplifier is 2 inches of an adult hand. And now we review the back of the MI502 amplifier panel. In fact, the amplifier is not very high before Macintosh have made several amplifier higher than this. And now I am going to show you some of the terminal on the back of this amplifier. Which one is the input? Which one is the output? Nothing is different from the previous thing. You should be careful to put this plug into the wall socket and you should not carelessly replace the fuse with the largest amperage capacity. And make sure before you install the speaker, no wires are bumped and come into contact between the plus and minus. This amplifier works in class D where the input signal enters which the oscillator signal to produce a square wave. The amplitude will be amplifying after the square wave will be filtered into an analog signal wave. In the work of sound system class D amplifier, the efficiency is very high, more than 90% and it doesn't need a big cooler, heatsink or exhaust fan. Thank you for watching. See you later.